Hey, my name is Bay Rate. I'm one of the filmmakers at Valve. Before coming here, a lot of us have worked on big budget blockbuster movies. During those experiences, we realized that movies could be made much more efficiently and with more creative freedom. So we joined Valve, and for the last seven years, we've been creating movies in a very different way. I'm going to talk to you today about a storytelling tool that we built inside Valve's Source Engine. We condensed the entire pipeline of an animation studio down onto a single gaming PC. We're calling it the Source Filmmaker. To date, we've created over 50 animated shorts. You may recognize a few of them. These have actually served a dual purpose for us. The first is to be the marketing materials for our various games, and the second has actually been to be the technology test for the Source Filmmaker. For a while now, it's clear that gamers like to do more than just play games. We all like to watch movies, and we like to participate in the worlds that we spend so much time in. We built the Source Filmmaker so that we could efficiently share our creative efforts across all aspects of the entertainment experience. This means that we created all of our movies on location inside the video game world. While the movie's playing back, we can pause, reach into the frame, and change something. That's not a 2D video that you're looking at. You're looking at the 3D world of the video game. This allows us to combine the arts of cinematography, film editing, and animation so that we can make late project story changes. We can blade a shot, frame the camera, and change the meaning of a scene immediately. Did anyone happen to kill a red spy on the way here? No? Then we still have a problem. So let's take a deeper look at the character animation tools inside the SFM. You can capture motion, you can insert clip motion, or you can animate new motion from scratch. No matter how the motion was created, you can use powerful motion editors to modify any of it. And worst of all, he could be any one of us. The Source Filmmaker also features a GPU-powered facial animation system that allows for multiple characters to deliver subtle, nuanced facial performances with feature film quality lip sync. Basically, kind of a big deal. So let's show you what it's like to use the Source Filmmaker. Normally, a film director yells lights, camera, action. The Source Filmmaker, however, allows us to do this backwards. Action, camera, light. So here you can see a group of us is using the multiplayer game to mock in an idea that we had for Meet the Medic. The Source Filmmaker allows us to capture the game world, blade up shots, place cameras, add anything in the game world, pose characters, perform facial animation, re-perform a new take, tune lights, and adjust sound all without leaving the context of what it looks like for the final audience. All this means that you can think of these video game worlds as massive backlots for creative exploration. As contributors to the Steam Workshop continue to expand these worlds, the resources for storytellers are going to increase exponentially. With the Source Filmmaker, you can animate, create posters, and make movies, all by repurposing the video game world into a virtual movie studio. Today, we're pleased to announce that we're starting the beta of the Source Filmmaker so that you can start making your own animated movies. We're also going to be including the working session of Meet the Heavy so that you can reshoot, reanimate, and re edit it to make it your own. You can learn more at sourcefilmmaker.com.